Hello everybody and a good day to you all today. I'm talking about Beauty and the Beast episode number 7 on um, Point of No Return. This episode is directed by um, Jill Carter. And this episode right here, you have JT, I'm not JT, you have um, Vincent, he's on the run. Because he killed the FBI agent and now the FBI is after him. And he also has a bounty on the, on his head by these um, these people who are trying to kill him. So now he has two group of people try, going after him, trying to take him down. So he's he's out there on his own, trying to find the proof, the evidence that he needs to prove that he's innocent. And he's also trying to find the people who are behind this whole bounty on his head. Then you have Catherine, who's working with the FBI, but also trying to show them that she's loyal to them, and also trying to prove that she actually actually, actually wants to take in Vincent. And bring them to justice. Then you have Tess and JT and Heather, who pretty much deal with the consequences of both, of, both, of both the action of both Vincent and and Catherine. Now, I did enjoy this episode a lot. I had a whole lot of fun watching it. But the but the characters do one thing that kind of drives me crazy. They keep repeating the same patterns over and over again, and they expect different results, which means that they're crazy. Because the show seemed to have reverted back to the first season. On this time, it's a whole lot worse because now the FBI is after him too. Because they think he's some crazy nut job who's, uh, who's, un, um, who's um, lost control of himself and, and who's extremely dangerous. And they want to take him in by any means necessary. So he might end up being killed. Hopefully, hopefully that doesn't happen, but it might. But you had, you had a character, Tess Vergas, Tess Tariq Vargas, who is the chief of police, and she's played by um, Nina Lisa Umdrello. And and she told, um, Tess told Catherine this, you two have been doing this game for a long, long time now, and you're, y'all have been repeating the same pattern over and over again, and it has not been working. How about you do this? How about you and Vincent go to the FBI Tell them everything. He turns himself in. And then let the law find the truth. Because the truth is there. And once they find it, you really will be free. Because the truth will set you free. So how about you trust the law that you work for, that you dedicate your life to, and then trust them to find the truth so you actually would have justice. And then you can then that you and Vincent can actually work beside the FBI and then take down the people who are after you. How about you do that? That makes a lot of sense. Why not? It doesn't happen in this episode, but you want them to. I mean, because here's the thing. I'm enjoying the show. I'm enjoying the actors on the show. I've been enjoying this in the first season. I enjoy the chemistry between, between the whole cast. I like the fact that how they blend like how they've been the action and the horror and comedy in this episode right here. Um, there's this, there's this two scenes when Vincent grabs um Catherine when she wasn't expecting it, and the way she reacts to it is so funny to me that I actually do really enjoy that. He also does the same thing to JT as well, cause he like he does he uses super speed and he just grabs and takes him takes him away, just like that, Whoop, out of the chair. And the way she screamed and reacted to it just cracked me up. I mean, the show was good, and I really did enjoy it, but the characters made these dumb decisions that you keep on thinking, why? S- stop it. It's not working. Your plans are not working. Yes, you do save the day for a moment, and you do stop the bad guys from coming for a moment, but how about you do this? Instead of stopping them for a moment, and they come back again, how about you stop them permanently? Because... If they, had, if they had the FBI on their side, if anybody ever tries to do anything again, all they got to do is call them up and they will deal with it. Problem solved. Uh, duh. Because the way they're going now, I don't want this to happen. But it looks like Vincent might die. I don't want this to happen. I, I don't want to go down that direction, but if they don't actually work beside the law, if, if they're trying to prove that they're innocent, they're going to make things a whole lot worse and somebody's going to end up dying. Oh, so messed up. And then you have other people who are who, who, who done with the fallout. Let's take, take Heather for instance. Heather's played by Nicole Gale Anderson and she has a new boyfriend, Kyle, 
who's played by um Michael Rourke. And Kyle is a new guy in Heather's life. And he might be a good guy, he or he might be a bad guy. I don't trust him. I really don't. I, I hope he's I hope he's good, but because Heather trying to want to be in relationship want to be in relationship with him, but she got to keep it a, a secret. And and she uh, and she, then she then she wants to tell him, but she has to lie to him at the same time too, just to make him so he so he can feel better about the whole relationship. And I don't think that he, he and the thing is though, even though. He may act like he's a good guy. He may be the bad guy too. He may be one of the people who may be after Vincent. He's trying to get, get to Vincent to her. It might not be the case. Or it might be the case. I don't know. But for now, like I said, I am enjoying the show. I'm having a good time watching it. I always have fun when I watch episodes. I highly recommend it. If you haven't watched it for yourself, then check it out for yourself. Because it, it does a good job of blending like, like action, a little bit of horror, and comedy all in an episode. I always do enjoy that. I don't know where the show is going to go, how it's going to end, how they're going to start the big bad, how that's going to go down, but let's see what happens. If you saw this episode of Beauty and the Beast, make your comments down below. And if you have any thoughts or theories about where the show is going to go, leave your comments down below. I'd like to hear them. Well, that's all I got to say about that. So give my channel a big like to hit the thumbs up. Boom. And subscribe to my channel and share. I really would appreciate it, like I always say in my dreams and in real life. I am the Ninja Rabbit. A peace out of people's.